Coach, we have seen so many dramatic games between FGCU and Stetson over the years. This one has got to take the cake. Stephanie Haas, two free throws with .2 to go to give you the Ace Hunt title. Really, I don't even know what to say. Like, I'd already turned around, so I didn't even see the foul. Uh, you know, we were trying to run a play there, and they did a good job switching out and not letting us get the pass we wanted. And all of a sudden, we got tentative, thinking we had to keep with the play when we needed to attack the basket. And, you know, I'm just uh, proud of Steph Haas. I don't know, I'm, that situation where it's one and one, and you have to make both of them, and the kid knocks them both down. I, I'm just so proud of him. So for all intents and purposes, when she stepped to the line with, with .2 seconds left, there's really not anything that can be done after that. It's all in her hands at the free throw line. She looks at the scoreboard, trailing it by one, has to make the first one to tie it, rattles it home. Then the next one is to win it, and she calmly knocks that one home. And four straight years, Coach, based on regular season champs. Uh, it, it's a great feeling, and this one is probably the most rewarding because this is the best sketching team that, that that I've seen, and they were tremendous, and, uh, you know, they've got to be very disappointed right now. It's just that I'm glad to be on this side of it right now, and we know that uh, this may not be the last time we have to face them. There could be another battle yet in store uh, if both of us can regroup after this game and realize we have uh, we both have business to do. Well, Coach, uh, you have earned the top seed, obviously, in the upcoming A-Sun Women's Tournament. Gets underway on Tuesday. As long as you keep winning, all the games are at Alico Arena. You start on Tuesday night. Uh, when do you start thinking about that game, uh, and how long do you give yourself to, to sort of unwind and celebrate this victory? Well, when we get on the bus to go home, I'll be working on the next game, which will be Lipscomb. And uh, we know Lipscomb's a very dangerous team. In fact, they had Stetson in trouble on this court just uh, just over a week ago. It was a six-point game with about six minutes to go. So it's not easy to rebound from a, something this emotional and get your mind back right into the next game. And But that's what we have to do at this point because the game's on Tuesday. A couple of great seniors. Only two seniors on the floor today. Uh, Sims in her final regular season game for Stetson, and of course Sarah Hansen, uh, the leader in just about every conceivable category in the FGC record books, her final regular season game, and Sarah finishes with 15 points. Uh, what can you say about the great Sarah Hansen? Well, uh, it's a testament to her that she's won four regular season championships in a row. She's won the championship every year she's been here. Uh, you know, she's a very tough competitor and fortunately she had some teammates that you know Daitisha had a solid game for us offensively and defensively uh, thank you ha Steph Haas came in and hit all those threes for us and and the free throws that's uh, that's uh, unbelievable but you know Jenna Cobb was tough on defense and did a great job and hit down knocked down some threes for us and you know overall it was just a very tough game very draining game and now we uh, we at least get to say we're regular season champions, and now it's on to the you know the next step of this, which is try to win the conference tournament. Well, coach, thanks for uh, taking the time to join.